everyone welcome to fantasy lighthouse i want to thank you for joining me here today on my channel we are going to be taking a look at the recent past the present and the future let's get started spirit talk to me about energies that surround taurus in the recent past page of wands we have a message or somebody that wants to say something to you in the recent past this is fire sign energy aries leo sagittarius doesn't have to be a fire sign However, this is the desire to communicate or maybe you sent a message to someone. Somebody wants to speak to you about something is what I get here in the recent past. Talk to me about this page of wands. What is the page of wands here? Somebody wants to tell you that they can't stop thinking about you with the eight of swords energy and they've tried to detach from it, but they can't seem to release you, Taurus. And it's driving them crazy, which is why they need to communicate this to you. They can't let it go, all right? Now, if we're talking in context of something that has to do with business, then I feel like this person wants to talk to you about some type of project or meeting that they need to have with you because there's some idea that they don't want to let go of and they don't want to let go of you so you have to be able to identify the way this metaphor is hidden right these readings are not always in reference to love yes we have the page of wands somebody wants to communicate something to you right so it's up to you to determine if it's in reference to love to business a family member right but this person, they don't want to release you, is what I'm getting. They don't want to let something go. Tell me more about that Eight of Swords. What is that all about? What don't they want to let go of? They don't want to let go of their dreams, their wishes, something that fulfills them. This could be someone coming to have a conversation with you about them wanting to pursue their dreams further, but they don't know how to do it. And perhaps you will be giving somebody instructions on how to do that since you have many people that look up to you. And it doesn't matter what type of situation you're going through, even if you're struggling, there's people that still admire you and value your advice, Taurus. So somebody is coming to speak to you about their dreams or whatever it is that they're trying to pursue or what they need to do. It's like they need your advice on something. And I don't know if this is a lover or something that's happening at work. Tell me more about this Nine of Cups. The Ace of Cups. They really want this, okay? They can't let it go. It has something to do with their wishes. And it means a lot to them with the Ace of Cups energy being present here. So this is what somebody is coming to tell you all right i feel like perhaps this might have happened already but this is in the recent past i feel like this is what someone thinks of saying or doing so it's to be expected talk to me about the present Talk to me about this energy in the present. That was the recent past and cards are flying out of the deck, okay? So in the present moment, we have the tower, okay? So this page of wands person is going through a transformation. We have more Scorpio energy here with resurrection and the king of swords. They're asking you to help them gain clarity on something. 
This person feels like they've lost themselves in the recent past, okay? And right now, there's some sort of wake-up call that they're going through with that tower being present there. We have double Scorpio energy, and then we have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. And they feel like they're running out of time, that they don't have enough time to get this done. So this person is very anxious. Talk to me about the tower. What is the tower here? The two of swords. You got to tell them when they come to you that they're the ones that are blocking themselves, okay? Because I feel like they're making something seem worse than what it really is. And you're going to put them in perspective. So this person, I feel, is coming to you very anxious, nervous about something that's happening in their life. And so they come to you. You provide them with the instructions on how to move forward. They feel like they're running out of time, but it's almost like you have to tell them, listen, take the blindfold off, right? It's something like that. It's almost like they want to make something happen, but what effort are they doing? You know, what, what are they doing? Because I don't feel them taking the proper action. I feel like there's a whole lot of talking and they're stressed out and they're nervous, but is there a resolution that they're working on? No, you know, I feel this person right here is venting a lot to somebody in the present moment. It doesn't have to be you, but they're just venting. They're going on and on and on and on and on and on. Tell me more about the present. With this person, the hanged man, more waiting. They have to wait. Why do they have to wait? The more they wait, the more they're holding themselves back. That's what needs to be said to this person, and I don't know who they are. The more you wait, the longer everything else is going to take to get the process moving. Make your final decision and just go. You know, or stop blocking your opportunities. Why are you saying no to people when it's really yes? Why are you saying that you don't want to do that when you really do? Hmm, I don't know what's going on with this person. Talk to me about the future. Talk to me about the future when it comes to this person, the moon. Whole lot of water all over the place. Clarify the moon for this person in the future. Four swords. They're thinking about what is going to be revealed. Something is gonna be revealed. Everybody's gonna find out about it. And right now, it's like they're scared. I don't know what they're scared about or scared of. Spirit, what is the tower here? The star. Okay. So they're scared of a new beginning or tape. There's like, and I was going to say tape. So I don't know if this has something to do with music. I don't know. A mixtape. A tape. The lost tapes. Memories of what took place, what happened. They're anxious about that. It's a new beginning or the fact that someone's getting a lot of attention. 
that's making them uncomfortable. I thought they liked attention. They are very confusing. I don't know. I don't know if they're getting attention about something and now they're uncomfortable with it. They're thinking a lot about the moon situation right here. So if you want to speak up, talk. It's like cross watcher. If you want to talk, you got to say something, you know. The message is here. Somebody needs to convey something to you, Taurus, but they're having some major insecurities about it in the present moment. Something's popping off over there or internally within them, okay? You're going to notice that because this person's going to come to you. They're going to be very anxious and nervous. I'm already getting that, okay? Maybe someone's going to confess something to you that puts you in an awkward position because it's like, what do I say? You know, you know how when somebody tells you about something that they did, and it's like, why did you tell me you did that? You know, <laughs> why did you tell? Goodness, right? So now you hold the secret. You hold the secret, Taurus. You do something like that. You hold the key. This is hard on this person in the future. Talk to me about the moon. We've been getting the Six of Swords almost every day. Who is leaving, right? I almost say that every day. Clarify the Six of Swords. Who's leaving? Who has to go, Spirit? Who is the person that has to go? Ooh. Can I show you this, Taurus? Mm, somebody is worried that you are leaving. Who is the person that's worried that you're done? Is this your job? Is there a Scorpio that's concerned? Is there another earth sign? It doesn't matter what sign it is. Look at these images. That huge pentacle is you. And then we have Scorpio energy right next to it. This person is the four of swords to the moon. So they're worried, right? Four of Swords to the moon. So they're not really talking about how they're feeling, obviously. Then when I clarify the moon here, they're thinking about somebody that's leaving. And we've been getting that almost every day on this channel, right? And when I clarify that, they're scared to lose you. That's exactly what's going on with this person. Hmm. What do they plan on doing, right? What do they plan on doing? You know what? We'll save that for tomorrow. All right, so to book a private session, all of that info can be found in the description box below of this video. Take care.